anytime there's an ugly death or a injustice, that's emotional. It affected my father. And uh, I didn't know how badly it could have been part of his drinking, his alcohol. My father drank quite a lot of it. We've been working at like we're trying to forget it, like it's just painful, forget it. And now we can keep it as a memory because it doesn't have to be painful. We can let, we can let the pain and anguish that our, that our family has felt, we can let that go away and keep the memory. And I think that's what we should do. But I think at this point, having uh, the experience of meeting the Haglands did a lot to tell us that there are people like us on the other side of the coin. We had people there on both sides of the families, the Haglands and the Morrison side, that were eager to just make peace. I think this whole process has just brought a lot of calmness to my mom, to my uncle, which in turn helps me to calm down. Because a lot of, I wasn't here a hundred years ago, <laughs> nor were the other people that we met. But it's still my mother and still my uncle and, and great uncle that have some anxieties that reside around that. And you, you just can't help but get some of that from blood as it passes down. Who can I hold them to blame? What it's done is just uh, opened our eyes to see the other side of the story. Not that we have to believe that, but just having the understanding of the other side allows some healing to happen. I don't know if anybody's like, ah, just get over it, it's no big deal. It's, it is a big deal, has been. It really changes your heart. When you are seeking out to know the truth of the past and understand what they have gone through, how they could have felt. Each, each time, each year that the events would come up, it would, it would raise those emotions again of uh, disappointment, anger, and some fear. You know, uh, I can say, they did it. They were convicted. But for me, it's nice to see my family members just take a deep breath and say, this is some kind of peace that we can find so we don't have as much anger and anxiety about this anymore. A lot of healing took place in those meetings, and I'm grateful for the opportunity we had to meet them. And they came in with smiles. They came in probably nervous, but they were still smiling. They were eager to meet us, and we were very eager to meet them. So we're just going to go on and not let it bother us anymore. <laughs>